Dr. Raquel Hernandez from the Technical Support Department at Hunter. Uh, have you noticed that your system has been repeating the cycle maybe, continuously watering all day long? Well, I know why. You know why? Because you may have programmed too many start times and I'm going to show you how to get rid of them. First, we're going to turn the dial to set program start times. A program is simply a group of stations that share the same schedule and you only need one starting time to initiate a watering sequence of all your stations in that program. And we notice that we have the first start time at 6 a.m. So this is the, the first time a day that the program is going to start, meaning the whole sequence of stations are going to start running. Okay. Now we press the right arrow and we notice that we have a second start time at 6.15. This means the second time a day that the program is going to start the cycle. It may not start at 6.15 because you may have longer run times for your stations, but when it finishes with the first cycle, it's going to start all over again because you have told the controller to start a second watering sequence. Uh, we press the right arrow to advance to the third start time, and we notice that we have another starting time at 6.30 a.m. By the way, these are not your stations, just in case you were thinking that these were, are your stations. They are not. They only represent the number of times that you can possibly water in a day. So here, the person who programmed it was probably thinking that these were um, uh, the station numbers, but they are not. Uh, we advance to the fourth starting time, and we notice that there is also a starting time program. The only one we need, like I said before, is the first one, if we want to water once a day. Obviously, if we want to water multiple times a day, then yes, we're going to have to program multiple start times. So in order to get rid of the, um, to the other uh, extra start times, we press the right arrow. We notice we have a second start time at 6.15, so let's go ahead and get rid of them. And the way we do it is by pressing the minus button. We can either press multiple times or we can simply press and hold down the minus button until we find the word off. And off is going to be between 11.45 p.m. and midnight. If we notice, if we press the minus button again, we have 11.45. If we press the plus, we have off. If we press the plus again, we have 12 a.m. So again, um, off is between 11.45 p.m. and midnight. Then we press the right arrow and we advance to the third start time. So this controller was programmed to water multiple cycles in one day. So we also want to cancel it because we don't want to water a third time a day. So again, we press the minus button. We can hold it if we want to go a little bit faster until we get to off. If we pass it, we just press the plus button once and there it is off. We press the right arrow to advance to the fourth start time and because we don't want to water a fourth time a day, same thing. We press the minus button and hold it down until we get down to off. off. Perfect. Then we press the right arrow and now we have only the first start time. We don't want to water a second time a day so it's off. We don't want to water a third time a day so it's off and we don't want to water a fourth time a day. So we only have the first one at 6 a.m. and that's all we need so it can water once per day. Then we return the dial to run and that is it. I hope you found this video informative. If you have any more questions regarding your Hunter products, please go back to the Hunter website, hunterindustries.com.